Got a basement closet, and at the top of the closet, there's a shelf that houses our modem and router and everything. And our wireless uh, gets really warm right here. So especially when everybody's watching movies and stuff. So it kicks off a lot. And I'm going to build another shelf. I'm going to drop it down about six inches. And I'm going to cut a hole out of the middle of it and put a triple fan in there. So that's always blowing onto the equipment there. So hopefully that'll cool it down. And we'll see if that improves our internet speed and keeps it from kicking off. So this is pretty basic. I just cut the sheet out for the size that I want. I'm going to screw it down on the sides with a couple of 2x4s. So I cut two 2x4s at the width of this. And then when I find out how much height I have, I'm going to build a back for it. Once it's in place, I'm going to screw it back onto it so things can't fall off the shelf. And then I measured out where the center of it is. So I took my long, um, my long uh, yardstick there. Ran it across here, ran it across here, found my center point, and I measured the piece that drops into this. You don't want to do the outer part, that'll be too big. I want this to lip over the top of it. So the piece that drops into there was 16 by 5 and a half. So I measured out 8 inches on both sides from the middle, and 2 and 3 quarter inches from center, and squared that up, and now I'm going to cut that out with the jigsaw. Since this is already three and a half inches off the ground with the 2x4 punching through with the drill shouldn't hit my workbench. So I'm going to punch a hole in the corner there. That hole's just big enough for my jigsaw blade to fit in. And then I can cut the inside piece out here. You can put another hole in each corner or buzz it out as making wider and wider turns until you have a triangle shape that's just wide enough for your blade to fit in again then you can go down the next line. And the moment of truth to make sure your fan actually fits. Yay! Good fit. Throw a couple screws to hold it down here. Lock it in and go install it. Alright, hopefully this will keep the air moving just enough to make my router work better. Got it all hooked up, ran the power down underneath it. It's blowing and it's quite a bit cooler now up here. But it does not seem to have made it that much faster. So that might have all been for naught.